Hey, it's George, and what I'm about to show you might solve one of your biggest Excel pet peeves. Why do graphs resize when you delete cells? And you will probably know what I'm talking about when you see it. So here is our graph of sales by region. Let's say that we're trying to format this a little bit and we decide to delete a few rows here for whatever reason. And that totally hoses up our graph. Now, this is really annoying. Fortunately, there's a pretty simple fix. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click inside my graph. Now, this is kind of tricky. You need to click somewhere not like inside, like if you get one of these lines or if you're in this box, it's not going to work there. You need to be on the outer perimeter of the graph. So like anywhere in this bigger perimeter box, double click in there and then you're going to get this format chart area menu. Select this third one, size and properties, and you're going to see some object properties here. We're going to go with move, but don't size with cells. Sizing with cells is Excel's fancy way of saying resize this when you delete cells. Um, so I'm going to allow us to move this graph, but don't change the size when we, when we delete cells. This one would actually keep it totally in place so you couldn't move it or resize it. We just want this. So I'm going to select that. And now let's get this back to a little prettier size. Okay, so if I delete these now, that doesn't happen anymore. So, very cool little trick. I hope that that uh, eliminates a lot of agony on your part. GeorgeJMount.com, Excel tips and tricks. Head over to the blog, sign up and get your free ebook on getting hired with Excel. Lots of different topics to learn about, business analytics, career management, Excel, networking, and healthcare, because that's what I do. Uh, so cool. Thank you very much for listening. See you again soon. Bye.